Welcome back to this Let's Play of King's Bounty Crossworlds. Uh, we're still exploring Montero. Last time I went back to the temple and got us a few paladins we were missing. Stocked our troops back up. I was thinking we're back at the entrance. Let's see what let's see what some of these elevators go. I'm a bit curious. I haven't played Crossworlds in Avenging Angel. Okay. I haven't played Crossworlds in quite a while. Hmm. So I don't remember everything. It's a, uh... It's a benefit or a curse, depending on how you look at it. The fact that I... My memory doesn't remember, like, the details of a lot of stuff. Like, for when it comes to books or games or movies. Like, I can enjoy re-watching something. Like, we re-watched, uh... Monty Python and the Holy Grail the other night. And I've watched that movie four or five times. There were still a few parts I was like, oh yeah! Like, which, you know... It allows me to get a lot of enjoyment out of stuff like this. I don't remember where this thing takes me. But apparently it takes me to the ends of the earth! Ooh, Dragon's Lair, huh? Lethal. I don't want to go there. We just took that long trip to where we don't want to go. Yeah, it says lethal. I probably shouldn't do that. All right, well, we'll just go all the way back. The real question is, would anyone, would any of you actually get on this device? Like, I mean, it's theme safe. It's not like that. I mean, there's not even guardrails. I can just, just jump off. But like. Does this device look like it's going to continue running? Not just, like, fall out of the sky right now and just kill you. Just, just saying. Looks a little sketchy to me. Oh, right now. Let me just look at this. Up, up, up. It gets you a nice bird's eye view, I suppose. As you fall to your death. <laughs> Alright, let's try this one. I think this one's just going to take me to, you know, an underground area, but... I don't remember how big it is. Let's find out. Montero Mines. Um, is there anything to dig up around here? Was that? I saw somebody coming. The equal in strength. Okay. Like how all these ore carts just have a pile of money in them. I mean, nine thousand coins. That's that's not some little bit. Manufacturing facility. Welcome to my factory. Bargain's the name, and I am the proud owner of this industrial center. We offer a wide range of essential products and tools. Yes, ma'am, at my factory, workers and engineers are engaged in all phases of manufacture, from invention to production, finishing, and finally packaging, all under one roof. My name's Emily. It all sounds very nice. Feel free to show yourself around the factory, and if you have any questions, I'd be more than happy to answer them for you. Okay, do you work for a... Do you have any work for a warrior? Hmm. Well, let's see. Fact is, there are a couple of problems I'm finding difficult to tidy up without some assistance. Shoot. I'm suffering some pretty heavy losses because of these fellows. The first thorn on my side is that necromancer, Mesmer. And the second is the fact that I'm currently experiencing a few technical difficulties concerning the delivery of some goods from the warehouse to my customers. Okay, tell me about this necromancer. Mesmer, the necromancer has us all a quaking in our boots. He's a pupil of Dark Mysticus and came uh, here under orders from Queen Hagney. That black wizard revives the corpses of fallen dwarves and subjects them to experiments, the likes of which would make your toes curl. Least away is judging by the equipment he orders from the factory. He recently set us a b sent us a bunch of drawings and our chief engineer took one look at them and fainted clean away. Now this kind of low-life behavior simply cannot continue. I am quite prepared to pay top dollar for the head of this monster. His castle is nearby in the mines. Just one thing. Let's keep the authorities out of this, alright? 
Hmm, all right. I like how it gives me a squirrel soul training. <laughs> Wait a minute. Who's the uh, who's the despicable one here? Why do you have this scroll? How dreadful! I will gladly save you from the necromancer. All right. Next. Tell me about the delivery of goods. I have a warehouse full of products that I'm fair itching to send out. I can't. My elevator done, uh, done, gone, and broke down on me. Seems it just wasn't designed to handle so much weight. I've already sent three of my assistants for a replacement gear, but they have, uh, but they've each returned empty-handed. Now I ask you, how difficult could it be? Maybe you would be kind enough to go on down to the linkage factory and bring me back this doggone gear. We need a lever gear of the third strength category. That's all. Say no more. I'm on my way. Get there and it's a million coin. <laughs> Alright, let's see what you got for sale. Uh, a flute. Hmm. This is junk. I'm not helping you manufacture a bargain if you're going to sell me junk. Alright, well, that's fine. I got those quests. I have no problem with dealing with a necromancer. I actually have a pretty good army for dealing with a necromancer. Thomas Torkova. We can't fight him. Hmm, yeah, he's level 40. What level? Yeah, we're only 23. Paladins and Inquisitors. That's going to be an annoying army, too. I mean, that's... That's all. Oh, gosh. Uh oh I'm sure I'm stuck. Oh, I guess we can fight him anyways. Um, uh, that's... Man, Paladins... And, uh... Mm, who don't want to die here? Paladins and, uh... Inquisitors. That's so much resurrection power. That just sounds like a miserable fight. Hmm... Mm, I got five green dragons. Hmm... Um, I think if there's something, maybe a better choice for a spell. I do have lightning, which does a decent amount of damage. I'm gonna wait. Let's wait a moment. Let's see what this dragon does. He didn't really do anything. Um. Let's fly here. I guess if I'm gonna wait a second, if I'm gonna do this, let's let's just throw a dragon of chaos down. That's fine. I'm gonna do the dragon steal mana ability. Oh look, we have 26 mana now. Um, let's go box. Yeah, let's go try to box this guy in again. Fine. Kill those. Good. Oh, wow, they're all attacking my... How many... No, he's got 360. I say they're all attacking my guy here. Sheesh. Give an extra turn to the snakes, I suppose. Uh, let's let's do the germination. Let's, let's summon up some troops here. Yeah, look at that. 860 thorn warriors are ready to fight. Um... I guess let's start hurting these dragons. Mm. What level are these considered? Level three. So if we do a crushing blow, we would just evict you from the area for a little while. Let's do that. Goodbye. Because they're not super fast, I don't think. No, they just had a, a running ability they used the first time. And my dragon just sit there annoyingly. And I've got plenty of mana. Is there something I could do to this dragon? What call of nature? It's so pitiful, though. Why don't we divine armor? My paladin, since I'm going to probably have them attack the... Uh... Uh... Just move them that way, that's fine. 
Oh, he did the ability I'm always doing where you steal, uh... You steal mana. Um... Hmm... Uh... Let's move here. My drag ability. And let's continue to batter the dragon down. Let's see if we can get rid of those dragons. Nice, a crit. We got two. Excellent. Oh, and another crit. Okay, well that went excellently. Rushing blow now on... On, yeah, let's let's work on these engineers or whatever they are over there. No, oh, they're about dead. That's fine though. Oh, you know what I should be doing? I should just do a heal. Might as well use my abilities for something. Or my spells. I got a lot of mana. It's kinda nice that the dragons can steal mana for us. That's that's a real nice uh Nice ability. Let's go after these ranged guys that are just shooting in the back. Right, that's why I want to get rid of those engineers right there, because they just keep summoning stuff. And a lot of it's these droids that are then just running around attacking us. It's like, mmm. It's like that. My paladins are way too slow, so I'll have them stay there so they can do a resurrection later. Fine, let's just keep our dragons in good health. And yeah, we're about done here, I guess, really. There's not a lot left. Surprise those Chaos Trackids are surviving. Uh, let's have him fall back. Mm, nap, snap. Um, okay, that's fine. All the paladins do a resurrection here in a second. Uh, and give an extra turn to the plants? Sure. Oh. Kill you? Hey, nice. Will you? Okay, good. Hopefully next turn we'll be able to uh, finish the job here. Um, crushing blow on this guy. The Inquisitors on their turn. I'll have them, you know, make sure. We don't have any, uh, any more resurrections to do. I think we're probably good. I don't know. Well, we're excellent. All right. Well, that went very smoothly. Nice. Perfect. Good. Which is good because we need to not be in this corner. That army, I'll say, that army was coming towards us. I don't need to be fighting that thing if I can avoid it. Let's see. That was... Wait, that's the way out. The... Those guys must have come from over here. Now that they're gone. The wheel workshop. Nice. Who's this guy up here? Equal in strength. Okay. There is nothing for you here. Goodbye. Wow. Excuse me? What do you do? I like how somebody says goodbye and we're like, hi. Can't you see? This is a wheel shop. Perhaps all these round things might have given you a clue. Now stop bothering me. I have a lot of work to do and I have to concentrate. Do you have any work for me? Oh boy, do I need help. I used to have my son doing part of the work alongside me, but now... Well, let's not talk about that. Do you know anything about gear ratios or how to temper metal or balance the axis of a pulley? Eh, well... To be honest, I'm afraid I haven't really studied this sort of thing. Do you have any other work? 
something a little bit less scientific. Ugh, humans, yes, I might have guessed. You people know nothing other than how to eat, drink, love, and fight. But you are a fighter, and come to think of it, that could be a good thing. I want to revenge my son. Probably more avenge my son, but... I've already been to the Miner's Guild, asking for fair retribution for my son. But nobody wanted to confront the crazy miner. Oh, I've seen him. So I've been biding my time, waiting and searching for someone brave enough to help me. Alright, tell me about your son. Odemus was my only son. A fine boy, but foolhardy. We always hoped he would become a wheelwright. I was even going to turn over the whole business to him when I retired, but... No... Wheelwrights were not exciting or valiant enough for him. His head was filled, filled with dreams of glory. But what could I do? He got some money together and left home. That was that. Well, at first he was quite successful. He was able to gather some ancient drawings and from those forged the axe of the elements. Armed with that cursed axe, he planned to visit each of the three kings and become a hero. So my Odemus went to battle the crazy miner one of the keepers, and died. And you thirst for revenge. My only son, my right-hand man, slaughtered by the crazy miner, struck down in the prime of youth. He never had the chance to become the famous master wheelwright I had dreamt of since his birth. Now my life is empty of hope, and only one thing sustains me, a festering desire to see that miner obliterated from the face of the earth. I am willing to pay dearly to see this happen. Okay. Uh, agreed. I must say I don't like these dead dwarven kings causing so much trouble for the people. I'll make sure that what happened to your son will never happen to anyone else. Thank you. Um. Hmm. Let's see if there's a... Yeah, I was going to say there's a leadership flag. 49 leadership. Equal in strength, that's fine. Uh, I can actually hold an, have another paladin. That doesn't do many. How much? Dragons use 1,900. Oh, so I'm pretty close to being able to have another dragon. Weakness scroll, sure. Is this good? Equal in Strength. Entrance to the Abandoned Mines. Alright, well, let's go kill Mr. Uh, equal in Strength here. Eh, what did he just do? I like how they slowly walk forward. But they're massively quick. Like, they're across the whole board. <sighs> what did he do, though? Uh, all miners in the army increase their initiative and speed by three. Wow. What was the other one? Doubles the base outrage and defense of miners in the army. Doubles? That's a lot of miners there. Oh yeah, look at that. I mean, they only got 22 health. But look at all the bonuses they're getting. Wow. Now they're really buffed right now. We need to kill them. <laughs> Nothing personal, but I'm going to need you to die. Um, let's... Uh... Let's not do that. Um, what's this fire rain do? That's the thing, none of these do that much. Sure, just do it. It'll kill a couple miners. Why not? It's pretty pitiful damage, though. Um, let's fly here. And grab this guy. Um, yeah, because we pretty much just need to wear these guys out. And actually, you know what? I keep forgetting crushing blows cheaper now. Let's just... Evict this guy from the area. Goodbye. And I can't reach anybody to attack, so let's second wind my Inquisitors. They can attack next turn. Um, Let's summon up some additional soldiers, I think. 
Even though I think we're going to mostly deal with these miners. Like, they got a lot of bonuses, but it didn't actually help them. But I think we'll be okay. That's the guy I wanted to go after first, that necromancer, but... There's so many miners in my face. It's like, if I don't kill them, I'm going to have a problem. Well, that worked... That worked pretty well there. Uh... Let's haste. I can't remember if I get... And you guys can let me know in the comment section if you know. If we go to level 3 distortion magic, does haste become maxed? Or not maxed, mass? Like where it affects everybody? Because if I could get a mass haste off... Mm, I might be willing to put it into distortion because, well, it's, it's kind of annoying. Currently, only being able to haste one guy. Being able to haste my whole army would be kind of nice. And I kind of feel like that might be what happens. I just don't... Uh, I don't remember. Let's go over here. Steal your mana. Next time, I probably should uh, put a heal on my... Uh, oh, let's have him get in front of these mi miners, the leaders. Put a heal on my dragons. Don't you summon up stuff? Dang you, what are you doing? Um... You know what, let's not forget to do that heal. Then I'll do crushing... Below, I guess, on these guys. Let's continue to try to wear this stack down. I think... Uh, let's have my snakes attack you. Kill off those zombies. Oh, man, he's taking a lot of damage. Ouch. Uh, he's still okay. He's still got 200, but that's still a lot of damage. Wow. Oh, I was going to say, I'm going to lose one here, I think. Hmm. E-buffs. Hmm. Well, if I don't lose a plant... If I don't lose a plant, I guess my resurrection from my paladin ability technically. Hey, Scott, that guy should uh, solve the problem in theory. That's so much damage, my gosh. Do the drag just because he won't get retaliated against, but this guy's just. Oh, th what's he got? One hit point? Five hit points. Wow. That guy's doing a lot of damage to us, though. I mean, my gosh. Thankfully, he's all they got left now, so. Yeah, that'd be nice to get the one that removes poison. I think poison was going to be that bad, but my gosh. Pretty bad. Um, let's just do that, I guess. I probably want the... I guess the plants can keep charging forward. Gosh, it's so much damage. Um, I don't want him to attack. I don't want to take the counterattack. Oh, he's still going to lose one. Holy... I can do resurrection on them, but yeah, no, I'm just gonna have the paladin do his resurrection next turn. Um, let's just keep healing. Well, I guess it doesn't really matter as much now. Since he lost the one, I was hoping I wasn't going to lose any. 
My hope is I feel like I haven't lost any of these other guys. Man, that does a lot of that ability. It does so much damage. My gosh. That guy is just brutalizing us. Okay. Um. Let's see now. Resurrection. In theory, we've only lost the dragons, which means they should all, in theory, get resurrected. He said, hinting broadly. <laughs> Hopefully that's what happens. My poor dragons, they just got that tar beat out of them. Almost got them. Man, they're still getting, I mean, he just keeps getting poisoned over and over again. He's doing a ton of damage. Let's see. We've lost one dragon. But yeah, I think it should get resurrected. Let's see, though. Oh. Uh, hmm. Lava call needs 48. I really gotta increase my rage. Sheesh. Almost never use this mana accelerator. I could. Stone wall, like I said, the health is just so pitiful. Let's do lava call. That's 48. Oh, yes, my grain dragons are back. 48, and I've got 47. What things do I have to increase that? Absolute balance. Maybe I need to go for that. Because the only other one is... Oh, we've already maxed out rage control, actually. Really? This is the one I was thinking of. Hmm. So our rage just... Who's this guy up here? Knights of the Old Republic is up there. <laughs> well, let's take a... Let's dig first. Let's take a peek into this abandoned... In air quotes, mine. Abandoned, except for this army of monsters. Beware. Dangerous area. Entry without a map of the passageways or a qualified guide is strongly discouraged. Well, that's good. I ended up right back where I started. Glad I'm so skilled that I'm immediately lost and end up back at the uh, entrance. Uh oh. Pardon me, I've made a wrong turn. Excuse me. Slightly stronger. Okay, so we might be able to beat them. Ooh, and we got a magic rune. Man, I get jumped both ways. Um. Wow. Why do they attack those plants so swiftly? Oh, these guys are all gonna lob fireballs too. Ugh. Um. A whole group of them. So I guess I should move this guy forward just to try to avoid that. Hmm. I could throw down the Chaos Dragon. He won't do much damage because most of these guys are immune. I guess the goblins aren't. I'll say most of these guys are immune to fire. Well, not immune, but what, they get 50% off or something. So, they don't take a lot, is the point. Okay, I guess that's... Oh, well, I guess that's fine. That guy just fireballed his own army. Good. I suppose if we can get more of that, we'll be doing really good. Technically, Lava Call's a dead ability right now. Because I'm one rage short. I really gotta find a way to get more rage. I wasn't sure. I mean, it, it's fine, but... Come here. Um, these idiots, they're just lobbing fireballs everywhere. Oh, I didn't real. Hmm, must have given him an extra turn? That's annoying. Yeah, this is kind of an annoying fight because 
pretty much everybody's a bunch of ranged, weak ranged guys. Like, they're not very strong, but there's, you know, lots of them running around everywhere. Good dragon dive. Yeah, let's try that. I'll say everyone's grouped up pretty significantly there. Oh, I just made it so my snakes can't hit anybody, though. Well, that was... That was a mistake. Here, we'll just give them a haste boost so they can still hit somebody. Lose a dragon? Oh my gosh. Alright, well that's annoying. We might just take some losses this time, apparently. Sheesh, these guys. And they all have this, like, hit and run ability, apparently, too. How annoying. Um, let's give our snakes another turn. Move up. We just kill you, right? Yeah. Huh. Trying to think about the best way to do this. I can't remember. Do the fireballs. Are they abilities that can come back? No, they don't have reload. So they can't do the fireball anymore. That's nice. Um, just kill you off. Good. Gonna need to group my army up in a moment, though. If I can do a resurrection. Just do a healing on you. Oh wait, this is... I need to back you up, actually. How much damage would my dragon do? Okay, he won't kill him. Let's do that, then. Um... Should be fine, too, even with a crit. Um... You're too slow. Do resurrection on the dragon. Good. Um, we need to just wait till next turn, I guess. I'm trying to not accidentally kill these guys. Oh my gosh. He That's super annoying. You made my paladins waste their turn. You know what? Could I cast Fit of Energy on him to make him get another turn? Ha! I can. What do you think of that, imps? Oh, it gave him one action point? Oh, wow. Well. Okay, I was say, please don't kill it. Please don't commit suicide by attacking those dragons. Okay, I think we're hopefully good. Because the only thing we have left now is... I think we lost some plants. I think. Yeah, so we lost four thorns. That's fine. We'll get those back. Okay, perfect. Yeah, this area might be a little too dangerous for us, but we'll at least get a little bit of loot here. Uh, Avenging Angel. I feel like... I feel like I've got a lot of scrolls right now. Yeah, I got 16 scrolls. The path to go that way. The path that way, and then the path we just were in. Huh. Well, I think we're going to stop right here. I'm sure stopping in a maze is a brilliant decision on my part, but... <laughs> We'll, uh, we'll see how it goes next time. Hopefully we can... I mean, it's not a maze exactly, but it is kind of like a, like a maze where you can easily get lost. So hopefully next time we'll be able to 
explore some more of it. We may not go too far because, well, some of the areas might be too dangerous. And I'm actually going to pause the next time when we, we load up the game. We'll have full, not full, but very high rage to start. Uh, if you guys have any thoughts or questions, let me know down in the comments section. And if you're enjoying the series so far, make sure you hit that sub button so you'll know when I release new videos. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you next time.